Welcome to Book Talks with Diane. Today's book is The Days I Love You Most by Amy Neff. Unforgettable and utterly romantic. The Days I Loved You Most is a heart-wrenching, life-affirming novel that asks, how much would you sacrifice for the one you love? In the summer of 1941, on the New England shores where they were raised, Evelyn and Joseph fell in love. Now, more than 60 years later, with a lifetime between them, they have gathered their three grown children to share the staggering news. She has received a tragic diagnosis, and he cannot live without her. So in one year's time, they will end their lives on their own terms. As the couple comes to grips with their fate, they retrace their past, the joys and regrets, the laughter and the sorrow that brought them to this moment. They embark on a journey to live out their greatest dreams and to comfort and connect with each of their children before they're gone. But as their final days draw closer, they must confront the stark reality of what they're about to do and make peace with the legacy they will leave behind for their family. Spanning the 20th century from World War II to 9-11 and beyond, The Days I Loved You Most is a timeless tale of unwavering devotion, a moving tribute to the enduring power of love, and a reminder that even in the darkest moments, there is always hope and beauty to be found. I gave this book five stars. I was really uncertain about this book. It intrigued me, but I knew it was going to make me cry. I am so glad I went ahead and read it. The characters are amazing. They aren't perfect, but they are humble, loving, and try so hard to be the best they can be. They know how to forgive and love. If you are a Nicholas Sparks fan, you will love this book. It will become, or it did become available July 30th, 2024. Amy, if you happen to see this, you are amazing. I loved every word of this book. Thank you to Edelweiss and the publisher for giving me the opportunity to read this book. It is one of the best I've ever read. Thank you for listening, and I hope to see you again soon.